Hello, my name is Bob Chandler, and um, I'm one of the ushers. You guys probably recognize me. Uh, we got to ask for grace today. It's my first time doing announcements. <laughs> but uh, like I was talking to Brother Chris today, it's like a leap of faith. So through God, uh, God gives me the words, it'll come out properly. Okay, how is our worship team today? Woo! Okay, who feels like worshiping Jesus today? Hey, hand raising. Okay, everybody knows we're a hand raising church, right? Okay, well, I noticed some of you didn't raise your hands, so we're going to give you a quick class in hand raising, okay? So first thing I want to do is you guys, if you want to join me, you can. You don't feel um, pressured, but you put your hands in your pocket. You kind of warm it up, right? Like any other class, you want to warm up. You don't want to get hurt. Loosen up the shoulders. Hands out. Okay, we all like to watch TV. Carry the TV. Carry the TV. Some of the kids like to play video games. Big screen TV. Okay, big screen TV. Okay, oh, like Pastor Teresa, you know, we carry the baby. Carry the baby. Okay, carry the baby. Oh, my favorite, Mufasa. Mufasa. Circle of life. Okay, oh, a lot of the women, you know, wiping the windows, right? Wiping the windows, work it back and forth, right? It's all about God. We're worshiping God, right? All about it, okay? All those fills, what do we do? Do the nene. Yeah, do the nene. Don't ask me what that means. Hopefully younger people know what that means. Okay, we go back to basics. High five Jesus. High five Jesus. All about Jesus. Work it out. Work it out. Jump. We all jump, right? Double it up. Double it up, right? All right. Okay, we got football season coming up, right? Besides Campbell Middleani last night. Okay, that's not a good sign. But anyway, we watch football, right? So what do we do? Touchdown, right? Touchdown. And if you are pulling for Campbell, little heartburn, little heartburn, work it out, double heartburn, double heartburn, back to field goal, back to field goal, okay? There's more. So you ask me, Bob, there's more. Okay, for the more advanced, Titanic. <laughs> receive it, receive it. For Pastor Glenn, Superman. Tebow. Trying to loosen it up. Trying to loosen it up. <laughs> yeah, Matthew, Matthew 13, 14 says sometimes you got to you know, just relax, unplug a little bit. And uh, Anyway, so I got my announcements here. I'm going to have to put on my glasses, so hopefully you guys took pictures already. <laughs> I'm not shaking. Okay, first time visitors here. Okay, uh, we all, I want you guys to feel welcome. All right here, over here. Good job, good job. Uh, I want you guys to feel welcome. If you open up your bulletin, we have a connection card in there. On the connection card, I'll have your name, address, uh, email. We want to um, keep in touch with you. We have a lot of people that actually do read this. Okay, and on there we have um, uh, um, some of our ministries. You're going to see a checkbox if any of you feel led to do the ministries and help out. On the back side, we have the praise report, prayer requests. And if you like our service or um, any comments you want to make about the service, uh, feel led. And you can put it, we have ushers in the back at the end of the service. You can put it inside our little um, box. Okay, and, uh, and you'll notice in the back we have some refreshments and um, some CDs and some books. That's our connection area. So after church, please feel free to go in the back. We also have a lot of our worship team and some of our members to our church back there. Don't feel, um, you know, shy. Just go back there and talk story. And we have a bunch of CDs and uh, that's our connection area back there. Okay, now we're going to show an Omni video. New Hope Central Oahu is participating in Give Aloha, Foodland's annual community matching gifts program. Throughout the month of September, customers are invited to make donations up to $249 to the Legacy of Hope campaign at checkout. Individuals must use their own Maika'i card to make a donation. Foodland and the Western Union Foundation will match a portion of each donation made with a Maika'i card. Donations made without a Maika'i card will not be matched. All Give Aloha donations are tax deductible, so save your store receipts for tax purposes since it will be the only record you will have of your donation. You may ask the cashier for a duplicate receipt. Please encourage your family and friends to shop at Foodland. Extra brochures will be available at Connection Central. 
Join us on September 7th at Ali'i Beach Park in Haleiwa for our volunteer appreciation, family fun day, and baptism. We will be honoring the many volunteers who make church happen, and we will also be celebrating with those getting baptized. Come out for food, fun, and fellowship. How's those videos? <laughs> okay, um, also you'll find more information in you guys' bulletin. Um, it also shows what, what you guys just watched on the video and the different um, charities and things you guys can donate it to. Donate it to, sorry, I walked away from the mic, Portuguese. Okay, so we also have the men's ministry. That's the next one on the bulletin, men's ministry, all right. Is Kurt in the house? Right there, he's in charge of the uh, men's ministry. I believe it's uh, Monday night, 7 p.m. at uh, McDonald's right now, Haleiwa. So if any, every other Monday, so the next one will be next week, Monday. So any of you guys feel led, the men's, go talk to one of the men's, uh, especially Mr. Kurt Shimada. Okay, I'd like to call up, our, oh, hold on, real quick. Uh, one thing I wanted to bring up about the, um, some of the ministries, like you guys saw on the TV, that's kind of how I got involved with this, and... Um, Auntie Pam, God bless her soul, she came up to me one day and was asking me about would I be willing to do announcements. It was like swallowing a bowling ball. But anyway, <laughs> uh, leap of faith, you know, I, I trusted her and she's very good. She's the backbone of the church. She's behind the scenes doing all the little things and she keeps things in order. But anyway, uh, she felt like to, I could do it. I prayed about it. A lot of the prayer work prayed for me as well. And that's kind of how I stepped out of my um, skin and I took a leap of faith and looked at one of the ministries, and one of them was ushers. So that's how I became an usher. So anyway, I just wanted to give you a little testimony on that. And with that being said, if we can please call up our ushers. Okay, this is where we do our tithes and offering. If you guys are not a member of our church, um, consider this a blessing, a gift. And don't feel like obligated to um, have to give. If you guys are members of our New Hope Haleiwa Church, then... Um, just um, as you feel led. Okay, I got a prayer. Let's bow our heads in prayer. Okay, Proverbs 3, 9 says, Honor God with everything you own. Give him the first and give him the best. In Jesus' name we pray, amen. <laughs> 